Okay, hey guys, um, welcome back to my channel and this video is kind of crazy and it's something that I've been talking about for forever, how I was moving and it's crazy that today is finally the day. I am in Arizona, I don't know what time it is, I think it's like 8 a.m. right now. Um, the movers are here and as you can tell my room is completely packed up, like everything basically gone out of drawers and everything and I'm getting ready to move to LA. It's so crazy. I don't know. It's like a whirlwind of emotions. Like, I'm so excited and so happy to, like, start my new chapter and to really, like, grind and work and make so much more content and just do all the things I've wanted to do. But it's so crazy, like, leaving home, family, friends. Like, I've been saying bye to everybody. And it's just so crazy that it is finally here. Um, I'm so excited to take you guys on this journey with me from moving from Arizona to LA. I'm driving my car out today. Um, I don't have all of my stuff, um, like, in my apartment for the first, like, few weeks. So I'm definitely not going to do an apartment tour until I am fully moved in because I'm literally not going to have a couch for, like, two weeks. And... I just feel like I should have given you an apartment tour without a couch. But, um, yeah, this is going to be a crazy, emotional kind of vlog. So, if you would like to watch me move, I can't believe I'm saying that, then I guess keep on watching this video. And I'm going to take you guys along with me on this journey. It's so crazy. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Let's get started. All right, so this is my moving day outfit. I'm just wearing this black tank from set and then some biker shorts and this really comfy flannel, but I'm um, feeling a little bit under the weather today, if I'm being honest. My throat kind of hurts and kind of have like a stuffy nose, like foggy, but it's okay because it's moving day and I don't have a choice but to just push through. I'm getting ready to go hop in the car. I'm driving California, it's actually my first time driving to California like I've drove like sitting in the car but I'm actually driving so you won't get a lot of me vlogging on the drive but let's do it all my stuff is in the moving truck I'm kind of shook like I'm actually moving it's so like weird to me I don't know if well I'm ready I know I'm ready but it's just it's just weird like I'm moving to California like I knew it was coming but it's just weird that it's really happening. Like I have a moving truck. I literally have a moving truck right there. I truly don't know what Jet's doing. I really hope he doesn't. Is he gonna ride down that? Oh God. All right, people. We are packed and we are ready to move to LA. Let's go. All right, people, let's do this. Isn't that crazy? I literally have a moving truck. So my mom and David are driving the moving truck and then I'm gonna drive my car with both of my brothers in it and we're gonna have a little road trip today. I've never drove six hours before so I feel like it should be interesting. It shouldn't be that bad. It's pretty much a straight shot. And I'm just gonna play a nice playlist. Right now my favorite song is Playing Games by Summer Walker. I think that's her name. Anyways, great song. 10 out of 10 recommend. I posted on my snap, I mean my Instagram story yesterday, so great song, you should go listen to it. Um, yeah, that's kind of gonna be on repeat. Maybe let's do a few podcasts and then it'll be time to move in. Honestly, today's gonna be stressful though because so we had movers that were supposed to come last night to put all of my room inside the moving truck, but then they ended up canceling. So now that kind of pushed us back a lot of hours because it's currently almost 11, I think it's like 10.45. So we're gonna get to LA a lot later. We're probably gonna hit traffic, which is gonna be super annoying, but you know what, it's okay. As long as I have a mattress, I can sleep, right? Right? <laughs> and my shampoo and conditioner and my toothbrush and I should be good. <laughs> but yeah, I will see you on our drive. How are my brothers doing? Good. Good? We're doing good? Are you guys ready to get to LA? Yes. Who's excited to see my apartment? Me! I'm excited because I just got my apartment keys for the first time. I'm about to go see it. I'm scared because I actually am crazy and I'm literally moving in without ever seeing this apartment at all. So I hope that it's great. I'm sure it will be. Anyways, first apartment. This is so crazy. My first apartment. This is wild. Guys, this is so crazy. I'm literally 
literally in my first apartment ever. I'm so like shook, like this is crazy. It's like dark outside, I feel like I'm not getting the full effect of what my apartment looks like, but this is my first time like, I don't know, I feel like it wasn't real until right now and I'm literally in my apartment with boxes, like, this is where I live. This is crazy. It's gonna be a long night. It's currently, let's see what time it is. So it's currently 8.02, which is kind of late to literally start moving in. So we have movers here and we're gonna start moving in right now. And then I guess we're gonna start doing more unpacking and stuff um, right now, but tomorrow is definitely gonna be most of the unpacking and all of that. So I'll keep you guys going along with me. But this is so crazy. The next day, and we are still packing and unloading. What are we doing, Mom? Figuring out where my spices are gonna go. The really exciting stuff. Honestly, I didn't order anything. My mom kind of ordered all the kitchen stuff, and it's really cute. Look at how cute these are. I'm so excited about these. This is my most exciting part. Look at how cute they are. My other obsession are these little Halloween little towels, kitchen towels. They're so adorable. And then right now we have some people here helping me mount my TVs and whatever, but it's still a mess. The apartment is still a mess. I mean, look at it. It's definitely a mess and my room isn't even close to being done. But I just got my coffee table in too. And then I put this little tray on it. These aren't gonna be there. Those are for my makeup, but um, this tray, and then I'm gonna put some like books and stuff on it. But happy with my first apartment. It's gonna be great. I'm excited. Um, definitely apartment tour coming, but that's not gonna come until like probably like two months, just because stuff is still coming in. Like I'm not gonna have a couch for two weeks. My table hasn't come in yet. My table comes in like a week, so I still have some stuff to do. My mom's gonna have to come here in like two weeks so that she can help me finish it. I also don't have a ton of decorations right now, so. Need to also get some more decorations. But like I said, it's just my first time seeing the apartment. Like whenever I walked, it was my first time seeing it. So I honestly didn't know what to expect. And we brought a few, we're making it work. We're making it work. Cause I love it. It's so cute, I'm so excited. Okay, so I just got up and got ready. Today is Sunday, so. I honestly don't know how this moving vlog is going. I feel like I've tried to film as much as I could, but it hasn't crazy since it is like, whoa, please look at my hair. But since it is my first apartment, it's been kind of crazy and I've been wanting to just spend a lot of time with my family since they are leaving me today. So sad. But um, I put up my vanity. So if you know my room from at home, you know that I have this vanity at home, but I made it super organized. Like, let me show you. Like. Lipsticks and glosses, jewelry, brushes, and then here's some makeup. I need to fill this up, I just haven't yet. And then this is like palettes, makeup wipes, lashes, then I have in here, I don't really know, I think this is like face palettes, more lipsticks. And then down here I have, I don't not nothing really. I just know that I'm gonna have to fill up space too at some point. And then in here is hair, and then this is like lotion, perfume, aquaphor the best. Then this is skincare. Those are just like some bobby pins. And then this one has hair things. Yeah, and then. That's me, you. I literally look so scary and disgusting. Then yeah, I don't have a bed frame yet, so I'm gonna be sleeping on a mattress on the floor for a little bit, but it's okay because I'm here in LA, I have my apartment. Wi-Fi gets set up tomorrow, so I'm gonna have to figure that out by myself just because um, we had them come a few days ago, but then it ended up like not working twice. I don't know why, annoying. But I'm gonna get Wi-Fi today, and then I just finished up my closet too. So my closet's all done, I'll give you a little show of my closet. So it just kind of looks like that. And I put one of my dressers in here because I didn't have room. And then, yeah, so. But things are getting finished. My mom is doing the kitchen right now, but it's crazy. Things are like getting done and I'm about to be on my own. I'm a little nervous, but it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be great. I'm so excited for this next chapter and I'm excited to bring you guys along with me. It's definitely different and a change, but I think it's gonna be 
really good and I'm really excited about it. I just have a feeling that I'm going to start doing everything that I want to do and I have so many goals that I want to achieve and I'm so excited to bring you guys along with me on that too. Alright people, I'm doing adulty things as in grocery shopping. Right now I'm getting spices but my mom's picking out spices because I obviously don't know what kind of spices you should get because I feel like spices are like a random adult thing that you know how to do. <laughs> My goal is to not eat out every single day because I feel like I would just post me everything every single day. So I'm going to attempt to cook. I've seen my mom cook a lot of food, so I got a lot of things that my mom uses to cook. But I've also got these protein bars. These are the perfect bars. Guys, 10 out of 10 recommend protein bars. Perfect bars are literally the best. I eat them for breakfast all the time when I'm just on the go. So my goal is to cook food. That's why I'm grocery shopping. I got a lot of stuff. You guys need to hold me to it. You guys have to tell me in every video, are you cooking food? And make sure you're cooking because I really need to be. What are you doing, Bubba? Are you sitting in all my stuff? Hey, don't play with my food like that. Much done is my coffee table. It looks so cute though. Look, I have the Kylie Playboy then that tray I guess then it's just marble and this is my favorite candle it's literally huge let me see what kind of candle oh I just hit that but it is a whatever that says focus it's this kind of candle but it literally smells so good so pretty look at how aesthetic that is and then right now my brothers are sitting there but <laughs> my brothers are sitting there but it's literally just an air mattress twin size because a couch yet so I'm just gonna use that for now as my couch until I get one in about a week and then I also don't have my table yet so these chairs are just chilling here for now but they're actually my chairs that are gonna go in for my dining room table but my family is getting ready to leave in about like 20 minutes which makes me sad but I'll see them it's the holidays you know it'll go by quick I feel like I'm sad, but I'm so ready. I am giving total crackhead vibes at the moment. Why do I look like this? Anyways, I realized as I'm editing this video, literally currently, that I didn't film an outro, but it's okay because I thought I would film kind of a week later type outro and give you just kind of some insight to how living it alone has been for me the first, like, I think it's been two weeks since I moved, so the first, like, two weeks, and... It's been great. It's been super interesting. Like being on your own is so different from being at home. I had never realized how much my mom actually did for me. And I still did a lot for myself, but like, just like I've had to do so much cleaning that is really difficult and just trying to keep my place like clean and pretty all the time. I've had tons of friends over the past few days, which is nice. It's like nice to have freedom. Like I'm able to like, I don't have to ask my mom to do everything, which is really cool. And be like that. I love you, Mom, but it's nice not having to ask you to have people over to do things like that. So that's been cool. I've had some friends visiting me, and I'm finally here, like by myself, not having anybody here right now. And it's really nice. I thought I was gonna be a lot more like nervous about being alone, and I haven't really been that nervous. It's kind of been nice, like coming home to my own place and like nobody being here. I've always, I've always been a person, I don't know if you guys can like tell or if you know this, but I'm always the type of person to like have somebody with me, like I love to have friends and do things, and I think it's been kind of good for me to learn that it's okay to be alone and like do some self care and like be by yourself, watch a movie by yourself, and just things like that, but I've just been having to learn how to just be like really responsible, and like I said, Early in the video, I told you that I wanted to be cooking food, and I have been, which I'm really proud of myself about. I mean, it's only been two weeks, but I think I've only postmated like one meal yesterday, which is incredible, and that's what I wanted to do just because I feel like I would postmate every single meal of my life, and that's just not like the healthiest thing for you and stuff like that. I've been working out, starting to get into like my normal routine, finding my new nail people, eyebrows, all that fun stuff. So, starting to just get into the routine of everything plus keeping on track with just different meetings and auditions dance classes things like that so I definitely want to do a day in the life video of me here also following an apartment tour as you can tell I don't have a couch yet this is literally an air mattress as my couch I've just been having people over like I said so I just literally have left the air mattress there until my couch gets there 
but my couch should be coming next week. My bedroom is basically done. I just have to get one more sign in there, so that's good. That means that we're closer to an apartment tour, and then I got my table, my chairs, my kitchen's basically done. Everything right there is basically done. So it's coming together, and I'm getting really excited. Things are coming, and it's going really well. I mean, it definitely is hard being away from friends and family over there. Like, it was my little brother Jet's birthday, and I missed his birthday party, which made me kind of sad. So I don't know if any of you guys have moved out, gone to college or anything, and get, like, FOMO from those things, but I definitely am starting to get FOMO from, like, my friends being home and all that. But luckily, they came to visit me. I think it'll, I'll get more FOMO as it gets later into things. But I'm busy right now, so that helps, but... Yeah, I just wanted to give you a little update on what it's like being here alone. I definitely will do more updates and whatnot about just my life. And yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video and seeing the process of me moving, me leaving my family, and kind of giving you the rundown of what my first week is like. But if you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up turn on my post notifications so you know when I post a video and comment down below hmm, what should we comment down below comment down below what you're gonna be for Halloween because I want to know what you're gonna be for Halloween I'm so excited for you guys to see my Halloween costumes too so make sure to follow me on Instagram also Kalani Hilliker just my name so you can see my Halloween costumes and just what I post every day all right I love you guys bye